playing with my favorite toys. Mom. Bingo. Bluey. Welcome, everyone. Do you know how to tell time? Let's practice it. And as always, you will find links to the toys we see in the video in the description. Each of our players will get one of these cards. And we see a full routine for a day in their life. Here's one for mom, one for dad, one for Bluey, and one for Bingo. And the goal is to collect all those tiny cards and be the first who has them all. And in doing so, we will practice telling the time with our clock here. What is on the first card? A boy on a swing. It says 3 p.m. go to the park. So we are in the afternoon. The blue is called the hour hand and it is on 3. And the red one is the minute hand on 12. So let's see if we can replicate it. Here are the numbers 1 to 12. Our minute hand is on number 12. And our hour hand is on number 3. How would 3.15 look like? Like this. We move our minute hand. This is 3.30 and this is 3.45 and 3 o'clock again. So who is going to the park at 3 p.m.? Dad? No. Mom? No. Bluey? Mm -mm. Where is it? Here, Bingo is going to go to the park. What do we see here? Draw a picture at what time is it? We have our minute hand at 12 and our hour hand is at which number? 5. It's 5 p.m. Let's practice on our clock. 5 p.m. So our minute hand is at 12. And our hour hand is at 5. Who is going to draw the picture in the afternoon? It is dead over here. What do we see on this card? A girl on a bike. What time is it? Let's see. Blue is on number 2 and red is on number 12. It's 2 o'clock. Who is going to go for a ride at 2 o'clock? Dad! What activity is going to be next? Hmm, looks like food. Someone's going to have lunch. At what time? It's at 12.45. This means our blue hand is a little bit past the 12 and our red hand is on number 9. Do you know who is going to have lunch at 12.45 of the blue family? It is bluey. Speaking of food, someone is going to have dinner. At what time? I see a 6 o'clock. So how do we do this on our little clock? We need our blue clock hand on the 6 and the red one on number 12. So who will have spaghetti for dinner? Dad, Mom, Bluey or Bingo? Bingo! What do we see on our next card? Sing songs at 3.30. How do we show this on our clock? We need our, our arm. The blue one is slightly past number three and the red one is on number six, 3.30. Now who is going to sing songs? Hmm. Bingo? Bluey? Dad? Or mom? Mom is going to sing songs at 3.30 p.m. in the afternoon. Ooh, someone's going to walk the dog in the morning at what time? 9.15.
How do we show this on our clock? We need our hour arm on number nine and the minute arm is gonna be on number three, 915. Who has a dog in this family? Bingo, Louie, she has a duck. Mom has a cat and dad has the dog. Ooh, lots of toys. Put toys away. Do you do this every evening? At 5.45. So we need our hour arm a little bit past the 5 because it's already later than 5. And 45 is number 9. Remember, make sure our hour arm doesn't move. 5.45 p.m. Right before you go to bed, right? Who will put away the toys? Bingo? Bluey? Dad? No, of course it's mom who puts away the toys. Looks like some more food. Have breakfast at what time? 7.45. How do we show this on our little clock? Let's find out. Here, mom's gonna have breakfast. So we need the hour arm on our seven, a little bit past our seven. This is 7.15, 7.30 and 7.45. This looks like a puzzle, right? Complete a puzzle at 3.45. So three o'clock would be this, right? Blue on 3 and red on 12. So this is 3.15, this is 3.30 and 3.45. Who likes to do puzzles? Bingo, Bluey, Mom? It's Dad. What a surprise. This looks like fun. Go swimming at 9 o'clock. So we need our hour arm on number nine and our minute arm on number 12, nine o'clock. Who likes to go swimming, dad, bingo, bluey? No, it's mom who likes to go swimming in the morning. Who had the fish, do you remember? Feed the fish at 8.15. Let's get our clock. So we need eight o'clock would be this. 8.15 is the red clock arm on number three. Who had the fish? Dog, cat, duck and fish for bingo. Get dressed at 7.30 in the morning. So our arm on number seven. And how do we say 7.30, 7.15, Who's gonna get dressed like that? It is dad. Dad almost finished his routine. He needs one more card. Bake some cakes mm, at 4.30. So our arm on number four, right? This is four o'clock, 4.15, 4.30. Who likes to bake? Not dad. Maybe mom? Mm -mm. Bluey? Nope, it is Bingo. Bingo almost finished her activities too. What's next? Use the computer at 11.30. Blue is on 11 and red on number 6. And this was the one dad was missing. So he gets dressed and he walks the dog. He uses the computer, guides his bike, puzzles and draws a picture. Brush your teeth. 7.15. So blue is on 7 and red is on 3. This was the one Bluey was missing. And this is bedtime at 7.30. So blue is past seven 
And red is on number six. Who is going to go to bed at 7.30? Mom. Now she just needs to feed the cat at 12.15. Blue is on 12 and red is on number three, 12.15. She has breakfast, then she goes swimming, she feeds the cat, sings songs, put away the toys, and then it's bedtime. Have a bath at 6.30. Blue is a little bit past number 6, and 30 is number 6, remember. This was the one Bluey was missing. Watch television at 5.15. So blue is on 5, and red is on 3. Another one for Bluey. Play football at 4 p.m. That's easy. Blue is on 4 and red is on number 12. 4 p.m. Go to school at 8.30. Blue is a little bit past 8 and red is on number 6. 8.30. She brushes her teeth, goes to school, has lunch, plays football, watches television, and then takes a bath. Now it's bingo's time to wake up at 7 a.m. Blue is on 7 and red is on number 12. Last card is read a book at 1.45. So blue is a little bit past 1 and 45 is on number 9, remember? So she wakes up, feeds the fish, reads a book, goes to the park, bakes some cake, and then has dinner. Thank you so much for helping us practice telling the time. We hope to see you next time. Have fun! Why there's one more.